Hey guys, what is up and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing my surfboard, which is a Talk Modfish and it's 5'11". So it's a pretty sick board. I don't actually have a name, so go and leave comments down below on what you think I should call it. I have been using this board for a while. I do have other boards, but this is the one that I generally use. It's really cool. If you are wondering what wax I use, yeah, it's very dirty. I use West Coast Surf Wax. Put up an um, image of, you know, it here. Um, and basically, yeah, I just thought I'd promote them. <laughs> they apparently are vegan. I'm vegan. That's what they told me. So that's why I've got him. Because my, that's what I got. That's why I got those wax. Because most waxes do contain beeswax. So yeah anyway let's just get into the review okay so i got this board when i was like 10 or 11 um and i got it from a really cool surf shop called kite and surf it's in westwood ho if you want to go check them out it's really really cool they're the people that are really really nice and one of the surf coach guys i know him i don't know if he remembers me because <laughs> obviously locked down but um yeah, he helped me get this board and it's definitely a success. Um, it is pretty thick, but, you know, it is a fish board, so, I mean, what would you expect? Um, now, yeah, I have black fins on it currently, but I do have really cool fins. Hold on, let me just show you. Okay, so I've got it in this SES uh, thingy. It's very hard to open. I got it from the Wave in Bristol. I did go there once. Uh, I'll do a review on that if you want me to, um, I won't mention anything. Anyway, I've got some white fins, I obviously have three. I generally surf with three fins, I have surfed a quad before though. Now, in here, I've got some really cool, uh, fins. I have not ever used them, um, which is pretty pathetic, but I just really don't want to get a fin chop. Like, there's a few things, there we go, that puts me off surfing, um, like jellyfish and stuff, but I think the pros out outweigh the cons, but a thing shot, that just adds to the cons. I've, I haven't been injured too many times, so that's why I'm, like, pretty cautious. I'm sure it's not bad. Okay, so now you know everything about that, let's get into the review. Okay, so I really like this board because basically it allows you to do a lot of stuff if you're a beginner or an intermediate. I'd say I'm like an experienced beginner, if that makes any sense. Um, I'm not actually that great. I think lockdown is just really annoying. Anyway, it's really, it does let you do turns and stuff. I haven't really done too much. You know, again, I'm not that great at surfing. Um, but it definitely allows you to do like calves and cutbacks and calves <laughs> what i don't even know if that's the thing in surfing i've forgotten now i'm talking about skateboarding really aren't i anyway um it does let you do a lot of stuff i'll pop up some like videos and stuff um again i'm not that great so yeah um but i would highly suggest the board because like it's really great for beginners you can go anywhere, you can ride waves, you know, one to like 10 foot, I guess, uh, with this, I don't really know though, of course, but it does let you get on the smaller waves. I surf smaller waves quite a lot where I live, so it's not like bad or anything, but it's never like perfect uh, in North Devon, so, well, it is, it is perfect sometimes. But again, it's got that nice thickness, and it's also got the carbon thingy, my bobby, on the back, which apparently helps it like stay and like doesn't break. I've never broken a surfboard before. Well, I crashed my surfboard and I actually nearly died. I'll leave the video there on my other channel. Don't go subscribe, it's just not, I don't like that channel anyway. Whatever. It has a pretty cool nose like fit like a fish board well that's what it is uh, it's actually a hybrid fish though it's a mod fish i don't know anyway it's pretty it's not too carved like, or anything but it's you know it's got a nice little shape um so that's another cool thing um 
it's got the nice outline so you know like where to put the wax and stuff um it's it feels like you're longboarding very slightly i don't know why it just kind of does <laughs> i don't i really don't know why it just does um but overall you should definitely go check that out you can check out my videos as well because i've done like quite a few videos with this board in fact all of my videos on this channel are with this board i think um this is my main channel by the way i don't have like 20 other channels just have two more but you don't need to go and check them out because they're irrelevant and not good so yeah anyway guys thanks so much for watching this video if you do like surfing then hit that like button subscribe if you want to go comment down below again name ideas for my surf this surfboard um and maybe i'll make a video on like my wetsuit or my skateboard comment down below some video ideas so i can do in lockdown so i won't be able to get inside the water but yeah thanks for watching bye